A look at Trump Force One, Donald Trump's iconic plane that we took from New York City to yesterday's Army-Navy game in Baltimore. On that flight, Mr. Trump shared what was going through his mind on a long election night. You may be surprised. Well, I thought I was going to win big, and then I got these exit polls from you and others, and I was called by Ivanka. I was called by Jared, and they say these exit polls aren't looking good. And I felt okay because, I wouldn't say great, but I felt okay because I don't think anybody ever worked harder in that last, you know, couple of months. I think I outworked everybody. You were prepared to lose. Well, uh, do we have a choice, right? Uh, but I was very surprised because I thought we were going to win. When did you begin to think, you know what? This may turn out okay. Almost immediately when the first polls started coming in. A victory for Donald Trump in Ohio. As an example, Ohio came out. We were expected to win Ohio by two points or three points, and we won by almost ten points. We were expected to win Iowa by five or four, and we won by more than ten. Now it's around midnight, and Pennsylvania's too close to call, Michigan's too close to call, Wisconsin. That's the difference between winning or losing the presidency. How tough was that to wait for hours? It was so easy because they weren't too close to call. There were very you little... They were. No, I, well, no, you people, I think you were just trying to get some more commercial time in there because, honestly, Pennsylvania had 1% left, and I was leading by a tremendous number of votes. There was no possible way. Uh, Wisconsin, I was leading by a lot of votes, and there was very little left. Donald Trump will be the 45th president of the United States. Do you remember who the first person was to say, Mr. President? My wife, my family, my daughter, uh, and then everybody just started going crazy. And, and, and that moment when they say, Mr. President, President of the United States, what did you think? Well, it is a very surreal situation. I mean, all your life you're watching that on television. There's nothing better to watch. I know the folks at ESPN were saying that's one of the great things they've ever watched. And, you know, they watch all the great games and the fights and all of the things. And they said, one of them said it's the single greatest event they've ever seen. Boy, that map had a lot of red. You know, for people that were saying that there is no path, you know, before that was started, they were saying... All right, I, did, I said that. I said, well, he's got a very narrow path to 270. Yeah, unless you win states that nobody's ever won before as a Republican. So uh, it was a very exciting evening. And I, I tell you, the thing I'm most excited about is doing a great job. That's what I'm most excited about, because that's where it all started. And we came up with the phrase, I did. I'll take credit for this one, make America great again. And that's what we want to do.